Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I have a Michaels haul for you guys. Yay! Um, some of it is from Michaels, but these two are from Joann's, I believe. So let's just get right into it. These are some ephemera pieces that I got. Um, these were only like a dollar. They had the Black Friday, you know, special and stuff like that. So, I'll just go through these really fast. I won't take time on them, but let me just show you what comes in it. So, here is this piece right here. Cute, huh? Get a bunch of little cute, cute really cute stuff for... Um, anything really it's all Christmas ephemera so for December dailies or pocket letters you know this bunch of cuteness that's a cute little bingo thing that's really cute I was thinking of probably um, using some of these in a giveaway because there's just so many I'm not gonna use them all this I mean of course, I could always, you know, save them for next year, but everybody, they always come out with new stuff, so some little treats. There's just a bunch of little cute pieces. I'm definitely going to do a, a lot of pocket letters. Send them to my little pen pals that I have made since being here on YouTube, so... This one's kind of like, um, it reminds me of like a retro Christmas, like, I don't know, like in the 70s or something. It, just the feel of the ephemera has a little retro feel to it, I don't know why. This would be good to use in my, uh, December daily. I haven't done my, um, page for the 25th, so I might use that. Oops. Season greetings. This is a cute little train. I liked how these came with these cute little dresses. A little wreath. Just a bunch of cute little stuff. Which I'm sure anybody would love to get a few pieces of these. So let me just put some out here so you guys can see them. Super cute, huh? Um, yeah, these were only a dollar on Black Friday special, so I picked up two packs. It's a cute C. Some more little ephemeras. I have a bunch of little tiny ones. Happy Holidays. That's a cute one. I like the little snowman. He's cute. And then you get, like, a little December um, calendar. But, I mean, it's not the right date. It just says it's just December. So it's not, like, for this year or anything. But it's still cute. You could just stick it in your December daily or a pocket letter. Now, this one has... I'm not going to go th through this one. It has just way too much. But they are just... They're tags, frames, and, um, what else did it say? No, yeah, just tags and frames. So, you, here's a close-up of all the pieces that are in there. And you just get one of each, so you don't get double. That's pretty much what those consist of. Um, I'm going to be doing a collaboration Christmas project with the Clumsy Crafter. She has a wonderful channel here on YouTube. You guys should go check her channel out if you haven't already. So we're doing what is um, the 12 days of Christmas. This is my um, binder so far. She's probably going to make hers. Um... I don't know how to make them, so I just used a Target dollar spot binder and then just covered it up 
and some Christmas paper. I did make my pages though, and they are pocket pages. Ha, see, perfect. I haven't put anything in them yet, but our first video will be up on December 8th, I believe. So, I picked up this um, Project Life Christmas Wishes kit, and it has 130 pieces, and here are all the pieces. So there's all the big cards, and then there's the little ones, and then ephemera. So I'll just slowly pan it so you guys can see. And you do get two of each of the cards. Um, the ephemera, I'm not sure if you get two of each. I haven't opened it yet, but... You might. Well, you get 70 pieces of the ephemera. So, probably, because that doesn't look like 70 right there. And you get 30 of the little cards and 30 of the big cards. So, yeah, I thought it was really cute. And it's, you know, the colors aren't too traditional. You do have your green and reds. But then I liked how they threw in some blues and silvers and stuff they didn't they don't have any gold embellishment on this page it's mostly just um silver tones which is nice because we never really use silver so it's silver foil instead of gold this time and i like it i think that was a good idea to do silver so i snagged up some paper um Pads, and these are the 180 sheets and this one is the holiday basics paper pad from recollections and I'll just flip through it really quick now I um they do come three a sheet I however gave and gifting um, one sheet of each to um, my uh, cousin-in-law she is new at the planning and all the you know crafting stuff so I decided well I have 180 sheets I'm not going to use them all there's three sheets of each I'm going to give half of them to her well or a quarter of them I'm not sure so let's just flip through them really quick they have beautiful paper in here Ooh, went by too fast so some stripes which you could use this like for St. Patrick's Day it doesn't necessarily that have to be for Christmas that one could be just for winter some little stars I really like these ones the little Christmas ornaments those ones are really cute And then just some geometric shapes here. I love the candy canes. So cute, the candy canes. Um, these are some more uh, Christmas ornaments, which are super cute. Some green stars, which is so cute. The gingerbread, these are really cute. I really like these. Some little tags. Now, if you wanted, you could probably just cut these out and use them as tags, you know, but, or you can just, you know, use the paper as it is. I like to see what I can cut out and use as something else besides just as a scrapbooking paper. I love these little polka dots. Super cute. And what's funny is the, this polka dot print matches a print that I got, um, at the Dollar Tree, um, some treat bags that I got and the background is this exact polka dot which is kind of funny I don't know this one says merry and bright these are really nice little candles I like those some some stockings super cute these little lollies are cute I like them some more stripes they have a lot of stripes in this in this pad I like those which 
I'm not too big on stripes, but I did give a lot of them away too. So I did keep one or two sheets of each though. So I really like the, these ones. I you could cut them out and use them as washi strips if you wanted to. So I like that idea. Some little wreaths. Those are very cute. I love this one. Um, I use this paper in my uh, cover for the 12 Days of Christmas. Some more stripes. These trees are so cute. I love them. You could even cut them out, use them as a little ephemera pieces, which is really cool. I love the um, reindeer. So cute. Now, I don't know why they gave these blue hearts. It's kind of... Not to me, it's not Christmas at all, but whatever. People may like them. I don't know. Super cute. Looks like a little, um, a different take on a snowflake, I guess. Little candies. That's cute. Some more green striped things. Some polka dots. Some rainbow stripe, I mean stars. Cute little bells. I love this one too, the deer, so cute. Little Santa hats, those are really cute. More stripes, of course. <laughs> the snowmen are so cute as well. I love the snowmen. I think these are supposed to be little trees. And like a different type of tree. Maybe like a Charlie Brown tree. I don't know. These little pine cones. Those are cute. That's really cute. Little stars. These look, remind me of like a retro Christmas pad. I love this one too. That's really cute. Some gingerbread. Cute little... um. Snowflakes. I like the little trees. Those are cute. Some sleighs. At first I thought they were shoes. I don't know why I thought that. But they're not shoes. <laughs> At least I don't think they're sleighs, I'm pretty sure. These remind me of sprinkles. <laughs> I like the little envelopes. Those are cute. Some polka dots. Presents, mittens, some more polka dot, which is super cute. Little elf shoes, those are so cute. And then this is the last page. So you do get some um, cutouts you can use for either Christmas cards or your December dailies, pocket letters, whatever. So that was this one, and this is the 180 sheets, and it's called Holiday Basic Paper Pad. So this is my favorite right here. This is what I really wanted for. This one is Christmas, and I believe it's called Noel. That's what I'm seeing. Um, this one is also 180 sheets. I got this one for... Um, really, really cheap. It was more than half off, so I thought that was a good deal for 180 So let's go through it. I'll hold it. I hate to hold it that way, but I'll just do it this way then. So these are cute little mittens, and it says, baby, it's cold outside. How cute is that, huh? So again, you get the three sheets of each. This one is it says let it snow. It has Santa and then numbers randomly placed everywhere. This is cute print. I love this one. Oh, and the paper is super soft. This one's walking in a winter wonderland. So cute. 
this one I guess is supposed to be like snow speckles. And then they gave it to you also in red. Here's some blue snow, I guess that's what it is. I don't know. Good background paper though. I really like this green. And then they give you the same print, but in red this time. This one's really cute. They're skiing. So adorable. Some more background paper, which is really good. I love it. This one's really cute. I think it just says, over and over walking in a winter wonderland. I love this one right here. So cute. And this is just like, um, it has stripes, um, but it's just a gray background rustic type feel, which I really like that. It's cute. And then they gave it to you in like a green type color. At least it looks green. I don't know. Some polka dots. This just like blinds me. They're just too tiny. <laughs> then they gave it to you in green as well. Yeah, I love these little ornaments. These are like super retro ornaments, I think. Just the style of them. <laughs> I love this one. Can you see? Let me show you. It has the sand in the corner. Which, he's so cute. And then, just the background of snow. I think this would make a good um, planner cover if you use it this way. And then you could probably write something in there. So that's cute. I really, really love this paper right here. It's so cute. This one's really cute too. I really like this one too. These are just, um, I think they're like little holly berries in a bouquet. This is just another print. Good background paper though, I like it. Snowman, too cute, look at the snowman. I really love this paper. I'm definitely gonna use this. I don't know, maybe I'll make an envelope out of it or something, it's just so cute. I can make a bow out of that. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna use that one up. There's a lot of paper on both pads that I'm probably I'll wait till the end of December or January to see what's left. To see which ones I really didn't use. Because if I'm not going to use them this year, I probably won't use them next year. So I'll go ahead and gift those to someone. Let's see how that goes. But these are cute little snowflakes. Um, and this one also came in a blueprint. And here's that same um, print again, but the background's a little different. I love this one too, so pretty. Super cute. They're actually little snowflakes. I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but if you guys can see, it's little snowflakes. They are not polka dots. They look like it from afar, but they're t teeny tiny snowflakes. This one's really cute. Um, it would be a good background, maybe. I don't know. It's just, there's just so much. I don't know how I would use this paper yet. I would definitely have to mat it. Like, this would be the background and then put, like, a, a solid on top. But it is super cute. I do like it. This one, this one's cute. I like the color. Definitely a good background. This is really cute. Look at the little doggy. So cute. This one's cute too. I love this color green. I'm not too big on the bright greens. This one's cute. Looks like the women or kids rushing to get their presents <laughs> this one's cute it's like one of those 
rides up in the air and like a ski lift. That's what it looks like. And then the little back trees in the background. This one says, dashing through the snow. Hope you guys can see that part. Got the little snowman and a cute little dog. Looks like a little terrier. How cute is that? I love that. That's so cute. Oh, I love this paper right here. It's so cute. I love it so much, I don't want to use it. I just want to keep it, like, forever. <laughs> I really love this one too. This the reindeer at the bottom. Can you guys see that? There you go. The reindeer are so cute. I love the way it looks. Sorry, it's getting heavy. And then you get a bunch of like strips you can cut out and use them as washi, which I love that they give you those. And then here are some cut cut apart which these are just big cards if you want to use them in your happy planner you can use these as um, the journaling card for your weekly spread punch it and then you know have it in there or you can make these Christmas cards probably like this one this one and these two you could use them in your December dailies I don't know how you would use them in a pocket letter because they're really really big but I'm sure there is a way someone would figure it out. <laughs> this one's really cute. There's a little snowman right here. It says, let it snow. Let me turn it this way because it's getting kind of heavy. So you guys can see that better. This one's cute. I really like this one. Again, you can use this as some washi strips if you wanted to and like a weekly spread. I love the panda. I mean the polar bear. He seems to be carrying yeah, like a piece of a log, I guess. It, it looks like a Christmas tree, but it's not. And these are some reindeer, which I love. Some chevron. This one's really cute. I like these colors for Christmas, too. They're not as bright as the other one. This is really cute right here. Now these ones are the same as the other ones. They're actually little teeny tiny snowflakes. This one's really cute. I love that one. This one's so cute. I think every page in here is so cute. This is my favorite paper pad for Christmas. Um... I really like the non-traditional, like, blues and stuff for Christmas. It's really my favorite. So I really like it. And then I love this page. You can cut out all these little pieces. So even if you don't have extra money for, like, to buy ephemera packs, if you just buy this one paper pad, you have... A bunch of ephemera pieces you can cut out and then they give you three sheets so you wouldn't need anything more if you were short you know and you just bought this paper pad you get a lot of use out of it and this is the last page super cute I love it cannot wait to start using it but that's all I have to show you guys today so I'll see you guys in my next video don't forget to like subscribe and share this video see you guys next time bye